So I got the maple, which is uh, with maple butter. Oh my god, just look at that perfect crust to ice cream ratio. I have the chocolate and vanilla swirl. British Columbia in Canada and I am about to head off to my office which is located in downtown Vancouver so I'm gonna live the Vancouver lifestyle. I'll give you a quick tour of my Airbnb which is a one bedroom apartment located in Richmond. It's quite new and so spacious when you compare it to my studio in Hong Kong. So I am about to take the sky train, so they call it the sky train here in Vancouver, all the way to downtown to go to the office. So I'm at the Lansdowne station. Right now I'm in Richmond. And Richmond is pretty much like the Hong Kong of Vancouver. I feel like I haven't left Hong Kong yet. So in Vancouver, they have a compass card, kind of like the octopus card in Hong Kong. So I'm gonna buy a new compass card so I can just travel around. down to city center is about three dollars and fifty five cents and I noticed that it's quite funny that like people line up in an orderly fashion here and they're willing to walk up the stairs as opposed to just like waiting for the escalator just passing by the Vancouver Art Gallery in the backdrop is uh, downtown Vancouver. I'm currently in the office downtown, so I'm just gonna start my work and live my mad life. Think I'll stop playing hard as a matter of fact. I will never ever pretend that I'm more than that. It is our I know, but I'm scared as hell. Can you please just comfort me? You know so well this is tough, but I know we can make this work. I'm in love and it feels so great. So I got the creme brulee ice cream sandwich, but oh my god, just look at that perfect crust to ice cream ratio and the crispy caramelized sides. Never, ever, ever, ever. I'm on the beautiful BC Ferry, so I'm gonna take you around. It's really nice here, especially in the summer. Sometimes you might even see like orcas or a lot of wildlife. I'm counting down the days till we fly away. Heading to the sun, only you and me. Oh, don't wanna waste another day being stuck here in this place. No. So now I am in downtown. 
of Victoria on Government Street, which is the tourist area. There's a lot of like stores where you can just buy things like maple fudge. So I just got some maple fudge and that you can get here. So here I am Murchie's, definitely a must try when you come to Victoria. They have afternoon tea and really good pastry with snacks. Also really good for cakes if you want to get like a good birthday cake. Actually, since COVID, there has been a lot of outdoor seating that are like popping up all over the downtown area and I guess people just can go outside to have their dinner. So now I'm heading to the harbour, the Victoria Harbour, which is like the iconic scene of Victoria. So over there you have the parliament building, so that's where the legislative area is. And then there is the Empress Hotel here and that is uh, by Fairmont and that is where the Queen will stay if she comes to Victoria. I think she stayed like once before and she stayed in like one of the most executive suites ever. It's definitely a tourist town. There are a lot of cruises that come here. So a lot of the Alaskan crews will come through Victoria. So Victoria is one of the stops that people would stop at. So one thing to try when you're in Victoria is a beaver tail. So a beaver tail is like a piece of flat fried dough and you can put toppings on it like bananas you can also make it like savory and put like cheese and stuff on it so i think i haven't had one in ages so i'm just gonna get one so i got the maple which is uh with maple butter and it's extremely hot <laughs> it's like burning my hands but i'm so excited to eat this but it's burning my hands yeah try it's really good it's like a piece of fried dough and it's got some maple butter on it and some icing sugar so yeah, something you definitely should try when you come to Victoria, British Columbia. I'm in Beacon Hill Park right now, and I'm about to head to kind of like an attraction called Moss Lady. So it's this lady, and she is made out of moss. I think she's like lying down like this. I think it's new. I haven't seen it since I left Victoria. The trees here are like extremely big and thick. I think this one is a Douglas fir and there's a lot of indigenous history and a lot of indigenous culture with these trees. So apparently looking for the moss lady is quite of a adventure. If you don't know where it is, it's quite hard to find. Okay, so we found the moss lady. So you see here there's the head of the moss lady and then there's the body and she's just sleeping down like this. Like this moss lady started growing a lot of fern. Snowflakes are coming down Collapse into water when they hit the ground So behind me there are baby ducks Yeah, I think there's like 8 or 10 of them Yeah. <laughs> So one thing to do in my hometown of Victoria, British Columbia is to get soft serve ice cream at the Beacon Drive-In. So we're about to head in there and get some soft serve. I have the chocolate and vanilla swirl. So this is the ice cream soft serve, super famous. It's a great spot to be just here in Victoria for a day or for a few days. I'm crazy when I shut my feelings out. You look at me like I'm different. Still, you stay because you feel something real. Get so lost in my moments. Doesn't mean I don't need you. I, I. So, I think there's some fried chicken, some eggplant with some hot sauce on it. Colors, they kind of tell me what I'm thinking. I fell in love with the way. 